Hello friends, it's me. And today we are checking out creative people on the internet. I love you so much, Nail does the craziest nails on TikTok. And this time she made a claw. You know, people tell me I have claws. These are the most polite looking claws I've ever seen. The only thing these a claw is a mild armpit itch. Man, that's a lot of acrylic. You know, for a regular nail, you just put a tiny little layer over. You basically gotta like shape a whole new nail. Oh, she thick with a Q. Those kind of look like they'd be heavy. Like these are some bird claws. Oh, and then paint them black. <gasps> these are gorgeous. I mean, these would be perfect for like a cosplay costume. Literally any demon from Demon Slayer, they got those kind of claws, right? These are so cool, but like for the moment that you are in costume, then as soon as you get out, then what's she gonna do? Everything's gonna be awkward. You may stab yourself or a loved one. You know, perfect for stabbing and snatching hot Cheetos. This is one of my most talented subscribers. Her name is Wendy Rosa, and she does amazing portraits and paintings. She did an oil painting drawing me in my Nelly L cosplay. Like, look at this. I don't even know what to say. I wanted this portrait. I wanted to hang it up in my room. I love this painting so much. I had her send it to me, and somehow, with my luck, it got lost in the mail. So I went to my neighbor's house. Did y'all get an oil painting of me? Nope. Somebody has this oil painting of me. I don't know if they opened it and decided they wanted to keep it and hang it up in their house, but I would like it back, please. It makes me sad I couldn't see this gorgeous work of art in real life. That's not it. She drew this other picture of me in my cosplay, and your girl is so talented. You know, she could do it all. Can you please leave some skill for the rest of us? We got every single medium in this. Wait, this is charcoal. I used to draw a lot. I don't really draw anymore, but like, look at the finished product. This is the original picture. This is the painting. Like, it's literally flawless. Like, it should be illegal for somebody to be this talented. And like she even drew my sister, she drew my friends. <laughs> it kind of looks like she's missing a chunk out of her head. <laughs> it's funny because she probably is. <laughs> this dude, baking, bake king, baking. <laughs> I literally never realized that until now. Did he mean to do that? It's blowing my mind. Baking. Is it baking or is it baking? You'll never know. He did a cake of the alien. Like, I thought that was the real thing. It looks identical to the alien they found. I don't believe it because the government found it and said it was an alien. You know, everybody thought aliens were real until the government was like, yeah, aliens are real. You know, I hope that distracts you from really high gas prices. But then they came out with one of these and it ended up being cake. Vanilla with chocolate mousse. He died in a bed of Nature Valley bar crumbs. Aliens watching this video from another planet, wondering what kind of sick technology we possess. Turn their sun into cake. Okay, speaking of cake, it says cake, right? It's gotta be cake. No, it's a real hand. Stop! <laughs> nah, you're gonna have to cut the rest of it. I, I need to like examine every single little fingernail. This just blows my mind. It's even got hair. The arm is even hair. Bro's not a baker anymore, he a butcher. The detail on this is wild. Like, I wanna know how he did all the little tattoos. How do you tattoo a cake? Do you like airbrush it on? Maybe draw it with like an edible ink pen? You'll never reveal his secrets. Prime bottle or, wait, he's eating it. Oh, I like how it's orange on the inside. Wait, no, they're all cake. Yeah, somehow it looks better than the real thing. Yeah, I don't know about Prime, I've never had it, but these look so tasty. Are those cigarettes? Wait a second, they are white chocolate dip pretzel sticks. And then you dip it in some strawberry sauce and some black sugar. And wham bam, you got some edible cigarettes, ma'am. You know, growing up with a smoking dad, I always thought cigarettes were so gross, but I don't know. I never thought the day would come where I would look at a cigarette and my mouth would start watering. I mean, yeah, it's literally white chocolate dip pretzel sticks. Nah, this arrangement is crazy. <laughs> I imagine handing one of these out for Halloween. A cigarette for you, and I gotta start them young. Not for smoking, only eating. I'm sure this smells way better than the real thing. Bottle, hey, I have that same perfume. It smells really good. Now it's just a YSL bottle. No squirter, no pump, no squirter. Wait, that's not what it's called. Spritzer? What is the thing called that you press? I mean, sometimes my brain refuses to function. Oh, this is genius. They made a little diffuser out of it. The girls that know, no. These are expensive. For what? You can just buy a big bottle bottle of the fragrance oil that goes in a diffuser. Funnel it through the little hole. I like to live life dangerously. I would not use a funnel and half of it would end up spilling. My countertop would smell good, but I would lose half the liquid. I don't make good decisions all the time. And then you stick the little reed things in it and then bam, scent. This was such a smart way to repurpose it because it's like, what do you do with your empty perfume bottles? Throw them away? No. Perfume bottles are way too expensive to not repurpose them like this. Slice a cucumber and then connect it 
Like some Lego. What are they making? A little vegetable house? <laughs> yup, that's exactly what they're doing. You know, with every spoiled kid out there that doesn't eat their vegetables, some TikTok mother is going to make a vegetable house and pack it in his little lunchbox. This is kind of excessive. Wait, I can't tell if it's cheese or carrot. I swear that was cheese at first. Now that looks like carrot. No, it looks like cheese. That's carrot. That's definitely carrot. But the border looks like cheese. That's a carrot door. Hmm. <laughs> carrot or cheese? You pick. I forgot to hand my friend a blanket when he was sleeping and I woke up to this. What did he wrap himself in? <laughs> Is that carpet? Bro pulled up some loose carpet. Oh no, it's the rug. Mmm, nice and cozy. And reeks of feet. You know, of all the places to sleep, there's the couch right there. Bro chose the floor. I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to be inconvenienced. You don't even have to worry about it. I'm not going to like sleep on your couch and get it dirty. I'm, I'm, I'm perfectly fine right here on the ground. Literally rolled himself up into a rug burrito. I'm not going to lie, bro looks peaceful. Which one of these oranges is a drawing? I've fallen for way too many of these. Definitely not the really badly drawn one. Y'all are going too fast. I'm have to stop and slow it down a little bit. Those are three oranges gone. This is what separates the big brainers from the keyboard droolers. I'm not gonna let that crusty, musty Crayola orange drawing confuse me. That's a drawing. You're gonna wipe it off. It's one of these oranges at the bottom. I think the shadow is way too pronounced. Oh, I should have looked at the shadows on the other one. You know, it just went by so fast. The one to the right. Get rid of the top one. Be gone. So was it a drawing? I couldn't even tell. Yeah, see, it's not a real orange. It's on the paper. Yeah, I was just expecting everything to just like, pfft. no, that's so good. It's like when you see all six of them, I would have never noticed. I would have probably said it was the bottom left. Oh man. I even got like a little orange acne scar. I think this is probably one of the first ones I actually guessed correctly. DIY Lego flower wall. That's a lot of Legos. Whoa, I don't know what happened. I literally just blinked and we got a, a flower wall. Go, that is modern day art. She just took all these Legos, only used pieces of them. Do they even have like Lego flower kits? I've never even heard of that, but she made them. Whoa, literally a bouquet of Lego roses. Can you just buy those? Oh, you can. There's literally a kit for Lego bouquets. That's actually so cute. But instead of doing a bouquet, she just popped the flowers off the stem and then arrange them into this art masterpiece and then you could just hang it up just Lego art okay this is insane that belongs in a museum or the Lego store there was a water stain on the ceiling and they just put Big Bird's face on it there's no longer a water stain that's Big Bird watching over you from up above like a water stain guardian angel or a pervert I really hope this isn't a bathroom and the toilet is right below him look up and make eye contact the whole time you doing your business like hello Big Bird he seems rather excited this is such a good fix I feel like somebody stared at the stain long enough that it started to look like Big Bird oh we should add a face Paint a mural at Goodwill with me. Is that a bunch of letters? It seems like the Attack on Titan language. This. <laughs> the language of the Eldians. Oh, okay. We're drawing something over it. What was all the letters under it? If you're just gonna write Goodwill and then, okay, you know what? I'm gonna shut up and trust the process and see what's going on. Okay, they're just painting over it. Oh, I like when they do the letters like that. It's like when you got a used car sale. You gotta do it in like one fell swoop. No mess ups allowed. Oh, that's not that juicy TikTok paint I'm used to. See, this is a more realistic paint. This is kind of getting out of hand. Oh, those are some orange pants. Perhaps a green scarf, a pink one too, some clothes hangers. Oh wow, it just keeps getting more and more detailed. Do good and goodwill come to you. Oh, <laughs> I only like read it like three times like, what are they trying to say? Do good and goodwill will come to you. Donate your old pants, okay? Maybe something good will happen to you. Wait, that's a lot of detail. It's making my eyes hurt. Whoa, the finished product. You know, every time I see one of these murals, I, I don't like realize like somebody hand painted that. Like it's so good, it looks printed on. Okay, but look at this, how they like clean it up, the logo and everything. Oh, the letters are looking crispy. Big Goodwill fan. Now, every time I do a hack video where I buy a ton of stuff, it goes in a bag, it goes straight to Goodwill. Cause I don't like having clutter in my house. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and bell. Yes. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click. Click. And I just released some new merch. We got hoodies, shirts, tank tops at ogwolfpack.com. I'll link it below. And subscribe to the Wolfpack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.